So here I am outside the Circus Tavern with uh, Millie Thompson. Right. So this is a tough fight tonight, isn't it? Yeah, it's probably my toughest one to date. But, you know, as I've said before, I'll get in there, I'll fight whoever I want to fight, and I'll do the best I can. How diff different is it when you approach a fight like this, when you know you've actually really got a whole battle on your hands? You prepare, and then if you ain't prepared enough, then you don't do the hard work in the ring. So you got to do what you got to do. I train hard for each fight, so I mean, I haven't had the easiest time, only a couple of people will know that, but I haven't had the easiest time over the last couple of months, but, you know, I'm going to try my best. Yeah, I'm not going to pry, but difficulties in your kind of personal life and stuff um, like that? Yeah, and injury-wise, yes. and all sorts, and yeah, so, yeah. but is, is, it's not an excuse, do you know what I mean? If I, if I lose today, then so be it, like I was, uh, she's the better woman on the day, but if I win, then I win, do you know what I mean? You don't go in there thinking about the result too much. Yeah, well, best of luck tonight. Thank you very much. This is our ladies' main event of the evening here at the World Famous Circus 7. And this is six, two winning rounds. For the IBA Ladies Boxing Association Favorite Championship. Please welcome firstly, boxing out of the blue corner. Representing the Essex Kickboxing Academy.
Ladies and gentlemen, just witnessed there, which myself and all the officials, I'm sure the referee, Ian, will agree that is foul of the night tonight. Raise a room for both your warriors. Two ladies going toe to toe. Absolute class boxing from both boxers here this evening. The legend at the end of round four. The red corner retiring their box out as there was no position to continue. Your winner in the blue corner and the new LBA Lightweight Champion, Mimi Thompson. Once again, please congratulate Simone Skelton, but I'm with the new featherweight champion, the LBA, IBA, of the business tonight. Absolute class in there tonight, me. Should be very proud of yourself. How do you feel that you got that strap? Do you know what? Those that are here supporting me right now, you know I'm so ill right now, and I still. There's a difference between those who don't show and those who do show up no matter what. They love this sport and if you've achieved it tonight, you're absolutely class. I was talking to the officials throughout the bout and they were just saying your fitness is phenomenal. Do you know what? I've got a lot of people to thank. Everyone in my corner. Everyone that's sparred. And just everyone that's committed to sport as well. It means so much. Steve, we're just going to step Steve here. Steve. Steve, now, you've trained world champions. You've got another champion coming out in your camp tonight. Familiar Grand, how proud are you of this young lady? Yeah, very proud. I mean, she's been with us since she was a kid. And you know, she's come into her own, isn't she? You see her tonight. You know, and uh, she went well, really. She had a sick and cold this week. Like that. But she believes in herself. She's been a good sparring. She fits anything. So, yeah. Alan, it was a real chest for Millie. So no, is a seasoned, very, very good fighter, and you know Millie's come on the scene now, and she's very strong, very powerful, very fit, got fantastic trainers. I think she's going to go pro. She's going to do very, very well. Millie, the president of the IPA has been in this game as long as he's been alive. One of the biggest promoters on the scene. You've heard it now. What is next for you? Probably. 